Hello, graphic friends. Rasu is my name. Welcome back to the world's let's play with the world. Graphic one, Unreal Engine. We just witnessed Iberian going to sleep. The sleeper slept him. In the video, he was being dragged to the temple, but for some reason, he ported here. So now we have to figure out what we have to do. Hey, you. What do you want? I'm delivering the data wow, that's what I, we say. The and guy's lying down, dead. To be the lot. Kur Angar, you have something for us, right? What happens now? The vision was very vague. It brought us more riddles than answers. But one thing was perfectly clear. I saw an orc in a cave. There is an old abandoned orcish place of worship nearby. The orcs used to bury their dead there. That's why we call this system of caves the Orc Cemetery. The Guru Baal Lakor has gone there with some Templars. Maybe we'll find something there to help us understand the vision. I need somebody to have a look around that place and to report to me about the situation. Why don't you go yourself? You are the leader of the Templars. Very true. Task is to protect the Enlightened One. I must stay here with Iberian and guard him. You have done good service for the camp. I trust you more than anybody else here. That's quite I'm bad. Asking you to go to the Orc Cemetery and report to me what the Templars have found. That's very bad of him. I mean, he doesn't trust his Templars that he knows for years, and he trusts us just because we brought to them an almanac and some eggs. That's quite weird. What will I get in exchange? You want ore? It seems my impression of you was wrong after all. But I need you. Here, take 100 ore. You won't get any more. Where is the Orc Cemetery? Not far from here. The novice Talus knows the way. You'll find him in the temple courtyard. He'll guide you there. Okay, so we know Talus. So that's how you protect him. You simply let him lay down on the cold rocks instead of bringing him back to beds. This logic, I, I really don't understand. They better have done better. It's dark again, so tell us stop smoking. We have a mission. I forgot if we trigger the third chapter or not yet. He said you should take me to the Orc Cemetery so I can find Val Lacor and his Templars. So I'm the gopher again. Yes. I just should never have lost that almanac. Well then, come with me. Let's go. Yeah. I thought you were going to be stuck there. We will not go to the Orc Cemetery yet. We will go to the Fire Mages and see if we can buy the the next robe, oh, we have to level up a bit. We might be able to, with the monsters around the camp there. With the, the next uh, robe, we are going to tank them a bit more, because we have to fight with some orcs. And the orcs might be stronger than we expect. I'm curious who lights all those uh, torches here, I've never seen anyone walking by. Don't tell me they had automated stuff back then. But looks like we didn't trigger the th third chapter. I really forgot about that. Because I see no new monsters. It might be that once we go into the castle that they are going to kill the... Well, they are not going to kill, but they are going to close the... The old camp. I don't believe spoilers are a problem for Gothic 1. I mean, it's old enough. It's over 20 years old that the game appears, so... Most of the people should know what happens in Gothic. Like 69.69% 69 .69 of the people would know, right? Come tell us, I'm not far behind. We might as well just go here for a bit and get some experience and then we'll go to the old camp because we need four more learning points. I'm not taking you across this bridge. I don't want to commit suicide. You must be mad to go in there. Even Balukur and his Templars didn't get out again. We'll see what happens. Go back to the camp. 
I'll be there later. Yeah. Mm, what about here? Can we fight those enemies here? Yeah, we don't find people. Oh, I mean enemies like that anymore because of the free aim. There are lizards. Even lots of them, they are sleeping now, look. Quite a lot of them. I didn't know about that option that they can sleep. They dealt no damage to us? Can that be? A bit weird. But we have to collect their stuff. Right, we have a torch. Better make use of it. Here is another sleeper. Oh, back there. We are so tanky now for some odd reason. I don't know about the bloodhounds, if we can do anything. We only want to, to level up. Nothing more, nothing less. Here is nothing, right? Hard, hard to see anything, if there would be anything. Except for that, yep. Too much flora and fauna is not that great. But flora, the fauna we are killing. Slowly but surely. Okay, let's let's see if we can deal anything to the if we can do anything to the bloodhound. Because if we can, then we might level up a bit more. Are they also sleeping? Okay, we are strong enough. Sadly, we cannot really play as a mage. At least not yet. Can we lure it? Oh, we lost two of them, so not what we actually... Hmm, not as hard as I expected, actually. We just need to level up, as I said. Just leveling up. Then we can go back to the old camp. Oh, there is one. You're shutting them. We need to eat. We're getting hungry. Oh, there is one sleeping in front of us. But here is also one. Now yeah, we are wasting... I know that... No, oh, the graphic looks weird here. But we are wasting our learning points, learning the the things that we don't really need. Like magic, circle of magics. But our aim was to play as a mage. He went to the magic. Doesn't look great to me. It doesn't appeal to me. Oh, it's so dark. I do enjoy the sword more in this version. We need light. Oh, actually, we have magic, right? Orc hammer. That's a very strong weapon, one-handed, right? It's better than what we have here. The hammer is hammer. We can deal a lot. Uh, we can deal a lot more damage, so we still need a couple thousand experience to level up. I believe on that this way there are a bit more enemies, right? 
that we can kill. I so miss the running speed. Yeah, there is. Luckily we got this hammer, we can deal with the golem. Five hundred experience, just like that. He has nothing? Nope. It's so dark, but up there we don't really want to go yet. Thousand one hundred and fifty. Ah, it's getting daylight finally. We might just have to go around and look for more monsters. Still dark on this side. What about or light? That's not what we wanted to do. This is a light, no mana. Something must increase our mana. Raven's herb, okay. But here, is, as far as I know, it's nothing. Can we jump? Oh, this is not water, right? Nope. My bad, I thought it would be water. We have to walk the same way that we came back here, so... We actually before... Oh no, we have to level up anyway. Because if we cannot learn the fourth circle, then we are about to learn the... the one-handed master sword. Or second level, I don't know if, if it's going to be directly master. Here are no new enemies, sadly. Only the words. Skeletons. Oh, I know where we can find more experience. I remember it's on the other side of this forest. There are some lurkers and some snappers. And I really, really hope that... Are there scavengers? Oh, really? There are. We experience. I really hope that they are going to sell us the high robe of mage. The mage. How did we miss those scavengers before? I really don't think we can kill the work, so. Exactly 1000 experience. We could try the works. Yeah, let's see how much damage we deal. I saw something somewhere. Oh, they are sleeping also. Oh, okay. Can we lure them? Yeah, the problem is we don't see where they are. We are just blindly shooting fire arrows. Ah, there is one. No way. Forget about it. No need to waste that much time there. I really thought we could uh, alert them one by one, but no, that's not a thing in the gothic one. Well, not in the gothic two either with the animals. But 
normally here are some enemies that we can kill. There are some enemies. We've never fought with the snappers. Wow. That was perfect. That was more than perfect, actually. So when we have to actually go to those uh, parts of the forest or the the map, then we already clear them, so... It isn't as bad as it looks. The works are back there. There are some wolves. Or a wolf. Oh, there is another one sleeping. Or am I mistaken? No, not mistaken. There are more. Okay, we level up. We go straight to the the old camp because we have to come here anyway to do those things and it doesn't make sense to keep going back and forth just wanted to have 25 learning points to see if we can learn the next circle of magic even though it's a real waste if we don't play with the magic but i'm just really curious if we can do it in the second chapter I don't think the third chapter got a triggered. Oh, a lurker, okay. Even two of them. Experience is experience. It was on our way anyway. We saw need speed. Like a lot of speed. So which way is closest? The entrance, I believe this one. Another scavenger? Oh yeah, because of the second chapter that got triggered. We haven't been on this road. We got quite powerful. We cannot take lots of uh, enemies at once, strong ones, but we are making progress. I like the, the light of the torch more. It looks more warmer and more welcome. Hey you guys remember me? We have to prepare to go to the cemetery, but I really, really want to do it in the high robe. Or that happens after we come from the cemetery. I, I really, really forgot. Taurus is asleep. Yeah, everyone is asleep. Oh boy, poor dad. Now we can actually go into those rooms, but there is no reason to. At least not yet. Are the mages? No, they, do, they don't sleep. They just simply wait here. Carista, my friend. Master? I'd like to wear the high robe of fire. You don't own enough ore. Oh, we can, okay. I am ready to enter the fourth circle. You have completed the first three circles. Now is the time for you to learn the secret. So they are not tied to the chapters. The magic of the runes is based on the stone. They are magic stones created out of magic ore. It's the same ore which is collected in the mines. This ore is endowed with magic formulas in the temples. There, the runes are converted to the instruments of our power. With the runes you control now, you have the entire knowledge of the temples of the realm at your fingertips. You have now learned everything I can teach you. Ah, okay. Understand the magic. Then you'll discover the secret of power. What about you? Rodriguez Torres, he's a merchant. Yeah, he has a weapon. I want to... What's this? Ooh, 1100. First we have to buy the other one. Firebolt we have, but this one, this is a new spell. Circle 4 mana, up to 10. Storm of Fire, okay, might be great. This one we don't need anymore. This crossbow we are going to hold on to. Okay. 
Yeah, I don't know about those armors. We don't need them anymore. Dexterity, okay, protection against fire. Can't forget it. Yeah, actually, we ha we have oh horn of a shadow beast. Do we have enough? We need this spell for sure. We have a focus. Those stuff we don't need. We need the money. I'm curious if we can get a, the armor, but it's really weird that only we and Coristo could get this one and others don't have it. That was it. Oh, not so much. But only we and Coristo wear this armor. Weird that only us could get it. We need this spell. Storm of fire. Okay, it looks a bit better. But we need more mana and we have five learning points. Let's let's learn them. We have six but one we are going to keep. Nice fifteen mana. You oh. borrowed something from me. Now you'll have to pay for it. Wait, that's what that was mine, my friend. Hey, that was mine. It deals no damage. Did the guards attack us? That's weird. Yeah, I hope he's not going to be mad at us when we come back. Because that was not intentional, it was my sword. Well, now we can go to the Orc Cemetery. You better stop that magic. I do like this one. Stop that sorcery, yeah. Deal. Lucky for you, but I would have enjoyed polishing your mug. Oh boy, we went the wrong route. But it's about the same, actually. Starting to rain. And it's so weird that we got a high robe of Magician of Fires so easily in comparison with other guys. Only we and Coristo have it. And then Coristo got mad at us for picking up our torch. We actually know what happens with them, so it doesn't really matter because I'm sure as soon as we come out of the temple, then this is going to be closed. Well, we have 10 extra armor, and we know that 10 extra armor is a lot in Gothic 1. We didn't check the other merchants, what they have, if they have any, anything new, actually. I don't know if that's an option to check them. We have to check our new magic. Oh, it's so dark. Oh, mushrooms. How could we miss those? The only problem is the night is quite long. Yeah, we are about to, to reach the cemetery. We didn't even get a chance to look at the robe, how nice it looks. If it's looking nice. D 
this in the original game, the cemetery is quite bugged. The ball that goes inside there gets stuck, uh, doesn't talk with you, the line that he has to, doesn't come to the right spot. But we are going to see if it's fixed in this version. This was the bridge, right? It's forever dark here. New ground. Okay, we have some magic that we can use. Okay, there are some monsters. Biter. Yeah, the, the effects are not really great. But we won't shut it. Oh, they, they, they deal damage to us. We forgot to cook our food. There are some orcs. We are going to use some magic on them. I'm really curious what they do. Yeah, this takes forever to charge. Oh, 10 mana is maximum. But one shot. Oh, the problem with this is the range of this, the hammer. Not great that we saw the other sword, which was much longer. So one versus one, it's not a huge problem. They have nothing, okay. But that means we can one-shot the other guy and, and fight with the other one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, the flame effect is so weird. Where is the other guy? Oh, there it is. There he is. Yeah, this word is much longer. Oh, the orc cut. He didn't. He didn't have a chance to. Yeah, this looks weird. Luckily we have a good sword. So we have to go inside. To the cemetery of the works. Oh, there is another one, sorry. Didn't didn't see you, didn't want, didn't mean to ignore you. Yeah, I have to time or, or hit otherwise. We are in it for one-handed but short sword oh they how, how is that guy here outside with the other works but the others are inside do we have to open it oh nice it opens we have to heal ourselves and then we will go inside so the the magic is not as great as we expected sadly but we can still enjoy it. We are all around her. So, we are going to go inside the cave and we might have to take a short break. And we will see each other in the next episode. Because here is going, some things are going to happen. Right? Those are the... Yeah, the, the timing of the swords, uh, the fighting is quite hard. Those are easy works. They are scouts, they are not the uh, warriors, which are much harder. They can hit us a lot stronger. 
So I guess I'm going to, to make a cut here. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Yep, we cannot look at the armor anymore. Yeah, it looks nice. Oh, we can actually. So, thank you very much guys for joining me. I'll see you in the next episode. Be cool and bye bye.